So in the last video, we tested a high pressure safety switch on this air ham unit, um, utilizing the same pressure generator and the magna helix. We can also test filter safety switches for the dirty filter indicators, as well as on some air ham units, we'll have a low pressure safety switch on the return side of the ductwork should any smoke dampers or anything like that close so we don't suck our ductwork in. Same procedure, it just depends on whether you're tying onto the high port, low port, and make sure that you're connecting to the appropriate ports on your magnet helix and on the pressure generator. And again, keep an eye on the pressure limits so you don't damage the internal diaphragms in these sensors by putting too much of a pressure on them. You need to be aware of the range that these things can safely operate in. Have a good day.